Hey there, Virgo. Hope you guys' week has been treating you guys well so far. Appreciate you guys so much. Let's find out what the cards are saying and what's coming out for you guys' highest good at this time. This is going to be for my beautiful sign of Virgo. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Virgo. Tell me about Virgo, please. Reconciliation. Secret. I don't like that. I'm trying to come back and reconcile in secret. One more. Rejection, temptation, communication, and longing. All right. So first off, like I said, this person is trying to tiptoe backwards and trying to reconcile with you in secret. This is somebody that is trying to figure out a way to tempt you with some kind of communication here. This is someone that wanted you to feel rejected and left out. So they're trying to figure out how to reminisce when the connection was still, like before you looked at them in this lighting that you look at them now. What's the overall energy for Virgo? Change. So understanding that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. So you've been making some changes. I feel like this past energy is trying to come back towards you and tell you that they've been making changes in their lives and blah, blah, blah. But this person's only doing that because they see that you have changed something up. So this person's trying to figure out how to guilt trip you. This is about us releasing any beliefs that no longer assist in our soul's growth here. It's like this person's trying to figure out how to make you feel bad so you'll take them back. Balancing out your life in all areas. Bringing a state of perfect harmony into your world. This person's trying to figure out how to balance something back out. Virgo. Virgo. Be independent and brave. So it's like lone wolf energy. If you're like me, I don't run in packs. I feel safer on my own. So somebody knows that you're in this independent and brave energy. That's why they're trying to guilt trip you. You're doing what you want to. So just chill and happy. In tune with your feelings here. Very balanced energy I'm picking up on. This person knows that you're just doing what you want to do here. And they know this. That's why they're trying to guilt trip you. Let go of your inner thoughts. So just make sure you're watching what you're telling yourself here. If you start having negative thoughts, redirect them to something positive. It's like this person wants to... Oh, you just need to let that go. Just let go of it. Like, they're trying to get in your headspace here and try to make it seem like you're overreacting. You feel how you feel, so don't let this person gaslight you. Virgo. Virgo. Sacred space. Take time to clear yourself. You could have a sacred space in your house here. Something about you just taking time out here and just clearing your energy here. So somebody could have some kind of sacred space in their house and you're on it. I just heard that. That's a side note for someone. So just make sure that you're cleansing yourself here. Let me get another one. Serenity. I choose to feel calm, balanced, and serene no matter what's going on around me. So again, just being in that, that chilling energy, feeling calm, cool, collected, no matter what's going around, whatever's going on around you, just still continuing to stay centered and grounded. Loyalty. You are a loyal friend. You remain supportive and loving, especially when someone is going through difficult times. So somebody knows that you're a very loyal person. So loyal to default, I just heard. So somebody is trying to get you to be supportive of them here. Somebody wants to like, you know, get you to look at them in a loyal light again. What needs to be surrendered for Virgo? What needs to be surrendered for Virgo? Surrender your belief and scarcity. The universe is asking you to open the infinite nature of abundance. And this way you can remove blocks in your life and succeed beyond your wildest dreams. So something here about, there's something about your mindset here. There's something here about you shifting your belief system here. Just really removing anything that is, tries to keep you in a, in a lack mindset. And I feel like this person would, would do that. I wouldn't let this person near me. Surrender fear. Let go of the fearful stories you are telling yourself. Stay in the moment. Focus on solutions and celebrate every baby step forward here. So like I always say, fear is an illusion. Punch it in the crotch. Somebody doesn't like that you're in this non-fearful energy. Somebody tried to induce fear or panic into you. Could have been spell work involved here. Surrendering your ego. So you've had an ego death. You like to be to service of others and you come from a place of a heart. And this person's got a big ego and is trying to get in the way of your life. There's something about your goals that are significant here. This, is, this person's operating out of their ego trying to come back towards you. Okay, about reconciliation for Virgo? The devil. Now, I wouldn't want the devil to reconcile with me. No, thank you. This is somebody here that painted you out to be dark. And this is someone that is like still got some kind of like a dark attachments to them. This person could be trying to reconcile with you because they could have very well 
sent something or been part of some like a group and tried to like send something dark your way and they feel like by getting back into your good graces like this devil energy will let up off of them and it won't tell me more just reconciliation oh yeah somebody here is trying to come back in here and manipulate you try to create a lot of false illusions and somebody here definitely did something sent something or was part of a group that was involved was sending you some kind of you know darkness here so you know how to transmute that energy and what goes around comes back around. I feel like this person feels like if they get back in your good graces, like this karma is going to ease up on them. It will not. Trying to come back here with like a small offer, trying to, you know, confess their loyalty, their stability. It's a page. It's small. This person could be focused on your finances here. So this person wants to try to guilt trip you. They want to try to cry them crocodile tears here. This is somebody that caused you a lot of sadness and pain and now they want to try to come back and... and Pull on your empathy. Somebody's being haunted right now. Somebody is, woo, somebody's being haunted right now. Somebody is not happy. Like somebody is getting, somebody is getting hit with some bad karma and being like, poo, this person's like, like I, this person could be seeing things in their room, like shadow figures and like something very dark is coming after this person or anyone that was involved. Man, this person could have tried to send you things to make you have sleepless nights and paranoia and things like that. This person's being haunted. They're spying. They've been watching you closely, observing you. So I feel like this person's been spying on you this whole time to see if you were affected by anything that was sent to you. And you take that energy and you transmuted it and put it down. And now this person's got a lot of baggage and burdens in their life here. This person, I'm telling you, this person was waiting for something to come towards you and it never came. It, it, the pushback was strong. Like your spiritual team wasn't going for it. So this is someone that now sees that you're lining up with what's meant for you and this person's angry. They're mad. I'm telling you, this person was part of a group. This is somebody here that celebrated too quick. They felt for sure that they had you where they wanted you. And now this energy is like, it's almost like they're angry with who they went into this contract with. And now they're trying to come rushing back in here with you and reconcile. Tell you about secret. So a lot of secrets, a lot of lies, illusions. I just seen that judgment car here. So I'm telling you, this person's under judgment. So something about a house is significant. There could be some kind of secrets about an inheritance, a house, something that was that belongs to you. So this person's trying to show up to your house in secret. Tell me more. Somebody knows something's over with, and somebody somebody's scared now. Somebody was either sent. Or was part of a group, or they paid they were part of a group that tried to make you not here anymore. And somebody is now scared because they feel like this is what's coming for them now. So this person, it's like this person is like trying to, to escape what they wanted for you. This person said that you were a player, that you were reckless, compulsive, but that's how they feel about themselves. Now this person didn't expect for you to take inspired action, and now they're trying to move towards you. This is somebody that didn't expect for you to balance everything out that was meant to keep you off off kilter and it, you just transmuted that energy this person for sure thought that they jumped to the right ship and they left you remember they left you behind to, to leave you sinking wanted you not here anymore and they thought they was going to take off and go towards whatever they wanted to go towards and their ship's now sinking and you're the one getting out this person is trying to figure out the right way to come towards you because you are over here evolving you are attracting everything towards you that belongs to you. And this person is trying to get a new beginning. And, and this person only wants to come towards you because they know you have some new beginnings coming in. Trying to figure out how to reconcile. And I'm telling you, there's something about judgment Ooh, and justice. There's some kind of court issues that are significant that the secrets are being aired out. And this person knows that they're under some kind of heavy judgment and they're trying to balance something out because they know that what's coming for them is not going to be good. This is somebody that wanted you to feel left out. They wanted you to lack. They didn't want you to have some kind of finances here. And all of this is coming to a head now. And now this person's panicking. Tell me about rejection for Virgo. Tell me about rejection for Virgo. King of Cups. Somebody didn't expect for your, there's something here about your emotional intelligence here. Somebody really worked hard to try to trigger you and try to get you out of character here. But again, your emotions, you're, you're very um, emotionally mature. And somebody could have tried to send something your way to make you feel mentally unstable, conflicted. This person could have gossiped about you and said that you were mentally unstable, that you weren't all there. But that's how you feel about yourself. Tell me more. 
This person's trying to come back and manipulate because they know that what's headed for them is not good. Tell me more. Four of Pentacles. Did everything in their power to try to keep you held back. And now this person's not feeling so good because they know that they can no longer hold you back and they're trying to hold on to try to, they're trying to hold, they're trying to stop whatever was meant to be sent for you. They're trying to stop it, but you can't. This person's trying to cling on to you now. The lights are being on. The lights are being on. <laughs> the uh, truth is being aired out here. Somebody doesn't like that you pulled your energy back and you went within and you just started like getting more in tune with your spiritual team here. These, these truths are coming out about what was done and, and said and sent your way. And this person is now realizing like, man, I messed up here. So this is somebody here that thought that you was going to be lonely by yourself. But here's the thing. You're, you're okay. Like you don't need anybody to make you feel important. That's where this person, these people messed up. So they could have tried to do isolation spells on you. You're moving away. Like this person could have had other people like, like, could have something about this person if they knew that somebody new was interested in you or like other areas of your life like people headed your way like this is like an energy where they were trying to get people to move away from you because they cause illusions confusions wanted to make it seem like they weren't making the right choice trying to build and collab against you and I guess that flashlight like I'm telling you the truth is being exposed and now this person's panicking because this person was contributed to this this is a breadcrumber. This is somebody that makes it seem like they want people's best interests, but they only do things because it, it serves them. So somebody tried to stop somebody from giving in to you or something was it, something was supposed to have been given to you and somebody tried to make somebody feel stuck or tried to look at, have somebody look at you in a different lighting, but all of this is coming back in a full circle as well. Tell you about temptation. The star. So... You've been healing. Somebody could have tried to do some like some send you some kind of like temptation to where you like go out and be like reckless and sleep with people and things like that. That didn't work either. Something about you're transmuting this energy. Somebody knows that you're rare and one of a kind and someone was jealous of this. So this person's trying to figure out how to heal this connection and trying to tempt you. I'm telling you, this person's got a lot of drama and, and chaos going on because that's what they wanted for you. And the 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 conflict and all this drama and these lies like it's all being illuminated here and this person is still trying to figure out how to how to get back into your life trying to tempt you i feel like this person said that you were tempted by anything that walked <laughs> you're an earth angel beautiful energy you've been healing and transmuting that energy so somebody now wants to try to make peace with you so continue balancing continue being patient with yourself continue grounding yourself this person knows that you've been pulling your energy back and something here about this person trying to make you stagnant, like no drive, like someone was also trying to make you like not feel well, something about your your mental state not being well. Somebody may be getting sick. Somebody could not, they could not be doing well mentally or physically. Like they, what they wanted for you is happening to them. Like this person's trying to figure out how to heal something with you. So there's some kind of offer that's coming your way and this person's trying to tempt their way back in. Like you've been just focusing on yourself, growing, evolving, just really focused on your stability here. And this person didn't expect for you to take inspired action. And somebody tried to make it seem like you weren't marriage material here. And somebody had somebody move away from you. Now this person's trying to figure out how to tempt you back into this connection because somebody knows that someone else is coming towards you now. And somebody here is like going back and forth because everything that was meant to knock you off balance, like you clearly transmuted that and stood right back on your feet. And you are definitely in this energy where you're attracting everything towards you that's meant for you. This is somebody here that sees you in this empress energy and this person knows that some others see you in this lighting and there's something about your new beginnings that are significant and this person wants to try to tempt you either out of your new beginnings or they want to tempt you in a new beginning because they know you have these new beginnings tell me about communication so this person's trying to figure out the right words to say to you so there's something here about finances with this person here this is somebody here that wants to try to get you to believe their solid stable offer here tell me more and i feel like this person only wants to come back because you're receiving something tell me more queen of pentacles so there's something here that you're definitely receiving when it comes to your finances here so somebody is trying to figure out how to get you to connect with them and take them back here. 
and somebody knows that there's some kind of communication coming your way, that there's something that was meant for you that's getting ready to head for you. So somebody is getting ready to like impulsively reach out to you because there's this action that's headed your way and this person's trying to figure out the right way to communicate with you because you have this new beginning coming in. There's something to do with court situations. So you could get some kind of like phone call from a court or some kind of mail. So the person knows you got new beginnings in and this person's like trying to avoid this this these scales being balanced out because this person knows that they've got some bad karma coming in for them. Talk about longing. Trying to come towards you with this heartfelt emotion here, but this is somebody like this person's nervous. I could feel their energy, man. They are they are very nervous. Tell me more. This person knows that you're moving away. Moving away from all the illusions, the confusions. You've got better choices coming in and they're panicking because I'm telling you, this person didn't expect for you to just like move through this with with ease, man. Trying to figure out how to get you to build, collab with them. The, the truth is being exposed. So this person's trying to figure out how to get you to give into this situation, but this person knows that you have shifted your perspective and you look at this whole situation differently. They're trying to get you to look at them in a different light here. That's why they're going to tell you they've changed. This person didn't expect for you to be so strong, and this person definitely tried to hold you back from something that's meant for you here. So they know that you're holding back, and they're trying to come in here and, and reconnect with, with this connection here. Time about reminiscing. They're trying to focus on the good times that you guys share. Tell me about that. Reminiscing. Tell me about that. Reminiscing. Page of Cups. Trying to come towards you. This is like somebody that's very emotionally immature here. This is somebody here that could have said that you were emotionally immature. So that's like a phony apology. He's not even in the water. He's on the ground here. So they're trying to... It's like they're trying to get you to reminisce when the connection was good before all this bullcrap took off. So this person is trying to figure out how to come towards you because they see that you're moving away. Like you're moving towards what's meant for you. Well, this person knows that you've turned your back and you've walked away. Like you're done. That's why they're trying to come in here and manipulate you. This is a very controlling person that doesn't like that you took power over the situation. Like this is somebody that is, this is somebody here that doesn't like, man, this person's like, there's like an ancestor here that is really like whooping this person's butt, man. Like, this person, like, I'm shaking. Like, this person's nervous. Like, this person is getting whooped. They're trying to, like, come in here and play the victim now because, like, I, I keep getting, like, I look at that, like, this person whooping, whooping this person's butt or anybody else that's been involved in this. This person could be trying to come towards you because someone else is trying to send them into your energy here. This very controlling narcissist person trying to come back. This person didn't expect how strong you are. You get knocked down, you get back up. You get knocked down, you get back up. And I'm telling you, this person's butt's getting whooped and they don't like it. You're getting ready to take a leap. And this is somebody here that knows you're going in a better direction. And now they want to try to come back in here and stop you from that. But there's something here about very heavy protection around you. Somebody knows you got your boundaries up now. And this is somebody that's trying to come in here and play some games because there's like an offer being presented to you. It's either something that makes you emotionally happy or you've got a love offer coming in. And this person wants to get in the way of that. Trying to play some games. See, this person thought they won. These people thought they won. But you just laid your store down and walked away. You weren't feeding into this drama here. And this person's trying to get back into your good graces now. I've got water, Capricorn, Virgo, Gemini, Earth, Fire, Scorpio, Water, Earth, Aquarius, Fire, Leo, Earth, Earth, Water, Water, Air, Water, and Cancer here. So this is somebody that's trying to figure out how to get you reminiscing. This person knows you don't trust them. You can't trust this person. They're contemplating. This is someone that's already been contemplating with you, towards you, with other people. This person knows you've got new beginnings coming in. And this person's trying to get back into your good graces. Trying to guilt trip you. Trying to make you feel bad. This person knows that you never gave up on yourself. Like this person, this person's like got themselves in denial that they're still hopeful that they'll get you to, to take them back. You never gave up on yourself and this person's confused. Look, you've changed your heart. See, this person knows that you're done. Like you've changed your mind about this person and they confused. And this person's also confused by how nothing affected you at all. I'm telling you, this person's very nervous. They know that something's coming to get the ASS. Virgo. There it is. I'm telling your ancestors, do not play about you. 
You've got, this person's got some ancestral karma for coming for you, man. You've got some gifts from the universe coming, the universe, the ancestors coming in. Well, universe too. Someone that you have a past with, so you could have like a past life connection getting ready to head your way. And this person wants to get in the way of that. But this person's butt is getting whooped by karma. I'm telling you, they getting battled, like big time. So somebody wanted someone to be weary and guarded about you. And somebody, um... It's like somebody wanted to downplay, like they wanted to, to go off of your past connections and wanted to make it seem like you weren't ready for this love or just that you weren't ready to, like you weren't healing and making changes like you said you were. So this person's got some battles that they done signed themselves up for because that's what they wanted for you. You've got some major changes coming in. This eclipse energy is significant. Cosmic intervention taking place in your life. And powerful changes coming for your heart here. You're a unicorn. You're one of a kind. Irreplaceable. Hard to find. That's why this person's working so hard to try to get you back. But you read between the lines. You know how to read people like I do. Very old soul energy. Be wise and pay attention. You can see the truth for what it is. This was somebody that risked this situation. They feel like they done gambled with their own life by trying to mess with yours. So this person is still trying to figure out a way to still roll with it here. How many more? Got a perfect match here lining up. Great chemistry. Highly compatible. A quick connection. And somebody knows this and they want to get in the way of that. Tell me more. Somebody's jealous. Somebody's protective over you. Somebody doesn't want to share you with someone else here. They're scared of losing you. Like, this is an energy that doesn't want to unclench off of you. Tell me more. Worth the fight. So, there's like a new person that's coming in. Like, they feel like you're not, like, you're, that you're worth the fight. They want to come in here for you. Fighting for your love. And then you've got this past energy wanting to come in here and conquer you. Somebody tried to gossip about you. You know? Somebody tried to sit here and really talk about your past. Like, Gossip for some people is a testimony for us. But come, come bite us to the table so we can tell you how God turned our lives around. So that's the type of energy I'm picking up on. Somebody is was wanted you to have a bad reputation and it just ain't adding up anymore. Tell me more. Clock is slow. Somebody wanted to slow down this progress. Somebody feels like something will take a while. Somebody something about some not not the right time. Like this person is like. Like, this is an energy where, like, no matter what they do, it's not going to be the right time to come towards you because it's over. It's a wrap, and they did what they did. Like, this person tried to slow you down. Battlefield, fighting, arguments, disagreements, not on the same page. So this person really tried to create a lot of arguments. I feel like this person's fighting with other people now because that's part of their karma. Like, this person's falling on their face, and you've got these two hearts falling in love. The feeling is mutual, equal effort, and this other energy worked hard to try to get in the way of this. And there it is. This beautiful old-fashioned love. Chivalry is not dead. Royalty is like royal bloodline is significant. You've got a beautiful offer of love. That's why this person's working so hard to try to get in the way of that. So keep that in mind. Virgo. Somebody wanted you stuck in trauma. Somebody's being haunted right now for messing with you, man. Your ancestors are really pushing up on this person, people that were involved. Somebody really wanted to highlight your traumas, your triggers, the things that you've been through here. Somebody was threatened by you. Somebody wanted, someone was intimidated by you. Somebody wanted you to feel bothered, feel threatened, be upset, and you clearly aren't doing any of those things. So you're just this calm energy. So this is someone that really is threatened. A bully. These are keyboard warriors. So this person, people that were involved, like, this is someone that moves behind computer screens because they won't say it to your face. They like to move through people and bully people. I can't stand bullies. Sometimes bullies need bullies. Tell me more. So there's that legal issues. I'm telling you, there's something here about legal issues. It could be a divorce. There's something about a house that's significant. There's some kind of scales being balanced out here. Somebody doesn't like these legalities are coming to, to light. A wolf in sheep's clothing. Someone could have said that you were a wolf in sheep's clothing, but you are. Drama starter, trying to start drama in your life. Tell me more. Because somebody was into you, and somebody is still into you. Somebody didn't want you to have this great chemistry with someone else. Trying to impersonate you. So this is somebody that could be, you could have like more than one person trying to copy what you do. You're authentic. You cannot be duplicated. So you can try your best, boo-boo. Try your best. 
So somebody here wanted to be like you, copy you. This is someone that doesn't have their own sense of self, so they copy other people. Tell me more. Groupie energies. I'm telling you, all these groupies. Groupies trying to come up against you. Like, I felt that. There's like a whole group of people that tried to come up against you, and you still come out victorious here. So step by step, you all go down. You're too busy winning to be worried about this stuff. Continue being in that energy. Somebody's a divination abuser. Somebody was definitely sending things your way. Somebody could have said that you were dark. You were the one doing this, but it's them. Somebody is trying to use their their magic to try to peep into your life here. But I feel like somebody's gifts are about to be stripped. Somebody's got some dark things headed their way for trying you. Somebody said that you were neglectful. You were an abusive parent here. So your, you know, your own children could have tried to come up against you here, which is freaking disgusting, but it is what it is. So you guys could have grown in and grew up in environments where you were neglected, you were abused here. So something about children's services is significant. Someone could work for children's services. Talking crap. Talking crap about you is what this person was. And these groups were trying to really, you know, gossip and run their big old fat mouth about you. This is someone that's trying to figure out how to get you, um nostalgic again trying to get you back into this connection with them this person's on the same stuff like they ain't changed this person tried to say that you weren't making any changes but it's them and now this person's trying to figure out how to force their way back into your life here so somebody already tried to to do some kind of like send some kind of forceful energy your way and all you, your ancestors pushed it right back at them let's just say somebody could have a lot of tattoos here moving on you're moving on you got a stalker so there's more than one person that's clearly watching you here. Somebody is, like, there's a new person that is, like, infatuated with you, but it's not in a bad way. So somebody wanted you to be stuck, limited. Someone tried to say you were making no changes when you clearly are. So it's like the spotlight was shown on you, and all it did was help you out because it proved, proved the point of you changing things. This energy is now stuck. They're now limited. There it is. I'm telling you, bad karma. This person's got some very bad karma. Anybody else that was involved, bad karma. Some of you guys are this person's karma here. Somebody could have tried to send some kind of death spell or pay someone to send some death spell your way. And it's going back to you times 10. So somebody's body is not doing well. Somebody's like literally rotting on the inside out here. And you've got an offer coming in. Love, finances here. Move in silence. Somebody's trying to act like they ain't did what they did when you already know what they've done. This person did everything they could to try to cause these scarcity tactics in your life here. Now someone else is scared because they got that coming to them. Somebody watching you from fake accounts here. Someone tried to say that you were dangerous, toxic, a karmic energy when it is them. They are this possessive energy. This obsessive lover is trying to come back and let me, you guys are moving. Somebody is holding a grudge because you're going to move or you're planning on moving or you have moved. Somebody's a grudge holder. Somebody's not happy that something didn't go their way. Like somebody wanted to win this battle and they clearly didn't win. Virgo. Virgo. So, you're like me. You rip masks off of people. Mm -hmm. Somebody could have said that you wore a mask here. And this person's trying to come towards you with this mask on it and pretending like they want the best for you. I wouldn't let this person near me. Something. Somebody could be at a distance. This new person could be at a distance. There's definitely energy where you created a distance and this this past energy or these people tried to really create a distance with this new person that's meant to come towards you here. Somebody tried to create a lot of blockages in your life here. Tell me more. You've got new beginnings. You're going in a new direction. That's why this person's trying to come back because you know they know you have these new beginnings in store for you. Tell me more. Spying. So dang, a lot of people spying and gathering information about you. And somebody's mad because something ain't working out like they wanted to. Somebody wanted somebody to look at you like in this angry light. Someone said that you were angry. You hold resent and hate in your heart when you're none of those things. This person said a lot of hurtful things towards you. And now they're trying to come back and make it like try to come towards you. No. Boundaries. Enough's enough. Drawing the line. Saying no. A castle could be significant. Drawing the line. Enough's enough. Somebody wanted you to be trapped, held down, held captive. Something about your energy not being able to be held down anymore. Somebody tried to do everything in their power to get somebody to look at you in, this, in a bad lighting. Somebody wanted to block your emotions. Somebody wanted you sinking in despair, falling apart. So this is how this person's feeling right now. So don't let this person guilt trip you because it is their karma. They reap what they sow. 
Continue keeping your silence. That's why this person's coming in to guilt trip you. Turn your back. Like this person, when this person thought that they had the advantage over you, they turned their back on you. So remember that. They wanted you to feel abandoned. They wanted you to feel left out. They wanted you to be left in the dark. And now they're trying to come in here with this mask on and smile. No, thank you. This person didn't expect for you to run right towards your ecstasy. Somebody didn't want somebody to run towards you because somebody views you as this ecstasy energy here. So somebody doesn't like that. You're still getting what's meant for you. Virgo. If you find yourself constantly seeing recurring numbers or words, it is a sign that you are being supported, cared for, and divinely protected by the universe. Beautiful things are about to happen for you. Don't be afraid to say I love you or thank you to those who deserve to hear it. Don't be scared of embarrassing yourself or appearing soppy. You will never regret a heartfelt I love you or a message of appreciation. You will only ever regret not saying it. So somebody wants to express how they feel about you. Somebody could have tried to say that you were soppy or something because you're a loving person. What is meant for you won't pass by you. You will never have to force something that is truly meant to be. <clears throat> Trust in the perfection of divine timing. and Allow your life to unfold as it should. Whatever comes, let it come. Whatever goes, let it go. So what's meant for you is for you. And this person can't stop it. They clearly tried to, but think again. This person's only coming towards you because they know that you've won something here. Don't This person will still get in the way of somebody that is supposed to be in your life. So don't let them do that. And there's definitely some kind of court issues that are getting ready to come to a head here too so all right beautiful virgo that was your guys's message i hope that it helped and resonated if it did not please check back with me on sunday we'll do it all over again guys appreciate you guys so much light and love to you see you sunday